This is a 2021 Nissan Kicks e-Power that got flooded sadly and we have to check it because the problem is understand that in Nissan e-Power the first component that gets the water when it gets flooded is the high voltage battery. So here it is. Main connections between one cell stack and the other is completely corroded. This bus bar that connects the cell stack definitely not looking good. There's a huge potential difference between the modules. One of them has 76, the other one has 63. So we're gonna check the individual cells to see what's going on. You can able to see it. And let's read the individual cell voltage. All right, so one, two, three. Here we go, let's see how much voltage we have over here in series. Nothing, nothing. The chain is completely broken in these cells. These cells over here, completely dead. So as you guys can see, this 2021 Nissan Kicks e-Power, the water came into the battery, flood the cell stack. Remember, this vehicle uses one, two, three, and four cell stack modules with individual lithium ion cells. And unfortunately, these four cells right here in this stack are completely dead. But the cell stacks in the Nissan e-Power, they're completely sealed. You cannot replace these cells, unfortunately. So the customer is gonna have to replace the complete high voltage battery pack. So if you want to learn more, stick around for more tips. Bye-bye.